Hey y'all, good morning. This is just a very, very quickie. I am outside <clears throat> sitting on the back patio, which is covered. I've been working in the yard pretty much all morning. I came and sit down to drink another cup of coffee and read more comments from y'all on my recent videos. And y'all, it seems that my videos are blessing y'all. Friends, it's not me, it's God. I am nothing. I am nobody. What I share is from God, and it makes my heart happy to see so many people, so many new people, being blessed by my very humble videos. I am trying to keep up with all the comments, but goodness, there are so many comments. I may miss some. I hope I don't. I pray I don't. I'm trying to keep up with them. It may be a day, it may be two days before I respond to you, but I am trying my best to respond to every comment. So I thank you. I really, my channel is dedicated to God and to further His kingdom. That's what it's all about. Nothing about me. I am not worthy on my own. But with Christ as my Lord, I've got to share. <clears throat> I want the whole world to know Jesus in a very close and intimate way as I do. As I keep saying, the world needs Jesus more than it needs anything else. If you're not a Christian, today is the day of salvation. Acts 16.31 says, Believe on the Lord Jesus Christ and you will be saved. There is no works on our part involved. There is nothing we could do if we began the day we were born and lived to be 10,000 years old. If we worked all day, every day of those 10,000 years, there's nothing we could do to earn our salvation. It is solely a gift to us from God through Jesus Christ who died on the cross so that all of our sins are totally forgiven, completely eradicated, seen, nor thought of anymore. I pray that you will accept Jesus as your Lord and Savior today. None of us are guaranteed an afternoon or evening or tomorrow. We all have sinned and sin will send us to hell. Christ died for our sins. The blood he shed on that cross is more than powerful enough to wipe away every sin you ever committed. And it doesn't matter how repugnant those sins were. Believe on Jesus and ask God into your life. Let him be the Lord of your life instead of all the foolishness of the world and do it right now right now friend i'm talking to you sinner and the bible says we're all sinners repent of your sins turn away from your sins let christ into your life and follow him be obedient to him instead of the world i love you I truly love you, but the love I have for you is nothing compared to the love God has for you. God loves you so much, he sent his only begotten son, Jesus, that whosoever believeth in him shall not perish, but will have eternal life in heaven with him forever and ever without end. Amen, brother. Amen, sister.